<laughs> did you guys notice Adam was down a little bit yesterday afternoon? I don't know if you guys caught that or not. He was a little bit down a little bit yesterday afternoon when the news came out about you know uh, Kanye West and Kim Kardashian. I saw him. A l- <laughs> I saw him a little bit. Uh, yeah, it broke my heart. But you seem opportunistic. You seem like uh, you know there was. Uh, you know, in a I, in a I prior see. podcast, you have yeah. given Kim some love. Yeah. So, what do you think about Kim and Kanye getting a divorce? Well, are, is that official? Well, I mean, that's public info. It looks like it's happening. Do you know how many kids they have together? By the way, is it three? four, four, four or kids five. together? Yeah, they have four. four kids together. Wow. Yeah. Good for you me. know what I found interesting yesterday? I saw Adams changing the way he spells his name. It's K A D A M, soft K. Catam. Catam. Getting ready. Right. Keeping that K crew together. Cat, the Catam Sosnick. <laughs> Shout out to the Koi K&K. Boy Mafia. Koi Boy Mafia. Yeah. No, but honestly, what do you think about it? You, you, you well, I told a, you the conversation I had. The last I know, conversation I, know, I had with Kim. I know, but how you well, feel? Were you, were you surprised when he got the word, or did you have some... Kai told me. He broke the news to me. Yeah. He said, guess who's getting a divorce? He goes, I'll give you three guesses. I was like, he's like, Melania big and news. Trump. I go, he's Melania and Trump, yeah. number one. Uh, and who else did I guess, Kai? I guess someone else. I don't know who it was. but um, And he goes, I'll give you one more guess. And this, he's like, this hit, hits close to home to you. I said, oh, damn, Kim and Kanye. Mm-hmm. But I told you, this. What the last conversation, we all know that one of my best friends, Chris Humphreys, married you Kim Kardashian. You were with Kardashian. him last week. Yeah. I was with Chris last yeah. week with his new girlfriend. Yeah. We were in Miami. I was in the wedding, the whole thing. And the last conversation I had with Kim, she says, I envisioned myself as an Elizabeth Taylor. Elizabeth Taylor was married how many times? Eight Not, times. Eight or, or nine, nine times. times. So basically, I was like, oh, this is the last conversation I had with her, however long ago. And she said, like, I'll be married a bunch of times. So this is now number three, and she'll be going on number four. The question is, who's next? Yeah, right? Yeah. She she seems like the type of person that likes to be married. You wouldn't think you'd get into a relationship, have four kids, and not think it would last for a while. So, But, you know, he's kind of gone off the I mean, she's been with him for almost nine years Yeah, for sure. That's, that's, That's long for her. By the way, you know he, uh, Elizabeth Taylor married Richard Burton twice. Yeah, exactly. Married, divorce, married, Remix? divorce. Remix. Yeah. So you're saying there's hope for my buddy Chris? Well, no. What, I, what I'm at? <laughs> make, so, make it so, past 50 days so this time. Here's a here's a crazy. 72. Oh, here's okay. a, here's 72. a crazy, straight, bro. crazy, crazy question. Yeah. And see what you say to this. Who do you think she will get remarried? To? Who Who do you think she'll get married to? Well, I know who it won't be. Who? A white guy. Okay. So yeah. who do you think she'll get married? I, yeah, I went there. Who Let's do you see. think she'll get married Need to? Need a name? Um, okay, so a uh, question to the audience out there. Would you be interested in marrying Kim? Here's the catch. You got to pay for her kids. You got to raise her kids. You got to deal with Kanye as the stepdad. <laughs> Why do you have to pay for him? She's got nothing. I'm money. just saying that's okay. the catch because who's going to be like, oh, yeah, I'll take down Kim. I um, don't think she needs your money, though. I no, don't I think know. she. I don't think Kim is marrying to because Kim she needs your ain't money. The no. kind of girl that it, it doesn't want a man who's like high profile and yeah, like strong, bringing bringing the heat. She's gonna want somebody that's got strong personality. Yes. Okay, yes. so it'll be an athlete or performer, maybe someone that's definitely in the public eye in a big way. Um, Bronny think- James, <laughs> ten years. I'm not sure. Maybe. See, I think she's gone past the athlete. Thing. Like she did the athlete thing, the Reggie Bush. Mm-hmm. Uh, Chris, she's gone to the rapper thing. I think she's going to go more the political, I think you're right. prestigious. She wants to be a lawyer. She's like gonna... a little bit more clout, you know, like not the rapper kind of clout, the politician, the investor, the billionaire kind of clout. I think she's thinking next level. Just don't like think Elon okay. Musk type of like an Elon Musk type. There you I've go. I've got one. There you go. Obama divorces Michelle. Yeah. He marries Kim K. Now that's a power couple right there. Yeah. That that kind of mentality. I don't think Obama's going anywhere. By the way, I think Michelle runs the pants in that family. However, I do think bite that's your, the type. That's, that's don't a, say that again. You're just offending a few there. people. I went there. I went there. I went there. You know, they, they I listed- do think that um, that's the route that she would go. Uh, a black, high up politician who, like a Michael Steele, who's the former RNC chair. Uh, Van Jones, who else we got? On? Yeah, the shit. The people are saying that on social media. They're throwing her with Van Jones. Really? Yeah, they're like hoping it happens. That'd be a good reality. She's gonna capitalize on it somehow. She's so smart. But I think she has made a little transition where she really does want to make a difference in the world. She sprung a few people from are you, prison. Are you a fan? Are I you am a fan of Kim. I, anybody that can. I, I'm. I'm not like. There's a difference. I'm like, I, I'm like, I like him. I've hung out with I him. I know certain hours not to call you because you're watching Keeping Up with Kardashians. I, that's, that, that's what I was right? basically you can't clarifying. can't call him when he's watching. I don't watch that stuff. I don't like, I, I never, I, I mean, if I'm with a girl and they're watching it, yeah, the, like I'll watch it. 
But I don't want. I, I'm not a fan like that. But I, I'm. I actually am a fan. Like, I, like I, she was a friend at one point. Sure. So like, I like her. I, I have are nothing you, bad to say. Are you rooting say. for her? Yeah. Are you rooting? Uh, for she's her? not rooting against the, the her. whole family. I'm rooting, I'm rooting for against. him. I mean, if you don't like him, don't watch him. I, Ignore I, him. I, I love. I've him. never watched Keeping Up with Kardashians once. I don't even know what the show's like. Dude, you're Armenian. What are you doing? I've you gotta never represent your people. It. I know. One time represent I was at your people, a restaurant called Kate Mantellini in Woodland Hills, and I'm sitting there, and it was uh, Chloe. And uh, Lamar, I said, what are these guys doing? Oh, we're shooting, keeping up a car. Down. Oh, that's cool. Okay. I used to eat there like five sure, times yeah. a week because it's right next to the office I had. But I am a very big fan of seeing her kick mm-hmm. some major ass. I just, I just am I'm a fan. Of, I'd love to see Kim make a major come up constantly. There's something very um, uh, 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 attractive, not even not even looks wise. There's something very attractive about her Appealing. personality. Mm-hmm. Very, the way mm-hmm. she carries her, herself, the way she does the, the interviews, the way she conducts herself. Uh, uh, I don't think that family is going away, and I'd be no. so curious to know what their next move is. Did, did you? Uh, this is actually a perfect culmination of politics, pop culture, rap, business. Did you hear what um, Kanye called? Chris Jenner. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Chris Jong Un. Chris Jong Un. <laughs> yeah. She's the runs dictator. a tight ship. Yeah. Yeah. That's pretty clever. Yeah. Chris Jong Un. Yeah. He said that on Twitter or he said that publicly or yeah, what yeah, was publicly, that? Publicly, publicly. I think it was on Twitter, yeah. Wow. Yeah, he blasted. It's pretty uh pretty ballsy. So what happens to Kanye? So you're now? saying his days are numbered. So, so I mean he called out his mother in law was the El Jefe. All right, so we talked about Kim. What happens with Kanye now? Because I, I don't know if you know this, he didn't win uh, president. <laughs> Sorry, you know, I, I think yeah, he's, I know. A, he's a genius creator. I think he gets, you know, he's got that place in Montana, just creating songs, albums. Go back to that. I mean, he's not probably looking for a big, no. high-profile relationship, and I would doubt that he has any struggles in flying women no, in when needed. So, but he it, did say one good girl is worth a thousand bitches. So, <laughs> I think a guy he like, did say that. I think a guy like Kanye maybe feels like he got overshadowed and he's going man I'm, i've done some things in my life and it's all forgotten yeah. because i'm with this crazy family i got a prediction i just thought Let's of it hear it i think this trump kanye 2024 thing is happening <laughs> it's happening they're both they're both going to be single they're both going to be divorced and they're going to end up together maybe that last part was a little far-fetched however uh the other part i think is i think they're going to be uh Trump and Kanye got a, a nice little bright future for you. It's kind of like the ebony and ivory version of who's, Frank who's, Sinatra. Who's got and a bigger Stevie upset? Wonder. Who's got a bigger upset? Kim or uh, Kanye? Kim, not even close. Not even close. Not even close. Really? Yeah. Really? Bigger Kai, upset? do you agree? Do you guys agree or no? I think she's got more mass appeal than Kanye. I don't. She think got Kanye... some more ass appeal. That whoa. <laughs> You know, I, I don't, don't believe you've never watched one episode of Keeping Up with Kardashians. I've never once oh, Pat, watched that means an you can binge Jen now. never puts it on the TV. I've nothing. never. Maral watches seasons. it. Maral watches it. Yeah, Maral okay. likes it. But well, I've a huge fan. Tigran, I couldn't tell you, but I know Maral's always talking about. You know, she she. Well, she's she, Armenian. She's Armenian. Girl. She's a fan of them. Sure. Yeah. She's you know, you know she can use so. as her model uh, J Lo and A Rod. Who would have ever thought they would be together? And that seems to kind of work. Mm-hmm. You mesh these two superstar brands. And by the way, who do you? Somebody said, some, <laughs> "Who do you think she'll be with?" Somebody commented, "The Rock." Another person said, "Mike Tyson." Somebody said, "Lynn Wood." <laughs> Lynn Wood. <what>? <laughs> <laughs> who he would end, she would end up with Meek Mill. Interesting. She, someone well, said she was spotted doing something with Meek Mill. Someone said Jack Ma, Jeff Bezos. <laughs> <laughs> P. Diddy. A uh, Jeff Bezos type. Uh, 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 who else we got here? Hillary, Von Miller. Von Miller's available. Yeah, Von Miller. Yeah, I don't uh, think He so. just had a bad breakup. I think she's done the athlete thing. She's get it. These guys' yeah. times have numbered. I think at this point in her life, by the way, she just turned 40 uh, yeah. in October. If The Rock hadn't just got married, I could actually see that. Combining those two brands, that changing the world. That, that, I think that's the level that she's that on. That would be scary. That's the level she's on. If if yeah. her and Rock were together, you know the Rock married an Armenian. He, he's got an Armenian wife now. Hmm. Really? Yeah. So you, he likes the Armenian. Test drive. So. <laughs> Getting ready for Kim. Yeah, I think I, I don't. I mean, look, Kanye's upside. What's his upside? Another album, right? Like, ain't nobody. He has no. Like nobody's voting for that guy. I think Kim can attach herself to a high-profile person, whether it's a, a must type, a rock type. And I would well, not be far fetched. You send her a text. I'll get her number. Say, I'll see you know, you should send her a text. I said, sorry about me the again. news. It's been like a decade. Sorry about the sorry news. Sorry about the news. You, know, you need anything? Um, <laughs> have you thought about Bitcoin? 
So if you enjoyed this little short segment from the podcast that we did, here's another short segment to watch. Or if you want to see the entire podcast, click over here. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.